Now coming in, model and actor Poonam Pandey is no more. We're given to understand that she's passed away due to cervical cancer. Her manager has confirmed the news uh, on social media. She was uh, all of 32. She's passed away. Uh, we do not know uh, if this illness was a long-term one or if it was uh, as sudden as her manager uh, put out on social media earlier this morning. Yasha, my colleague, joining us, getting us more details of what exactly transpired. Uh, Yasha, a distressing news there coming to the fore. All of uh, the age of 32, Poonam Pandey is no more. Uh, yes, uh, Poonam, in fact, uh, it was this morning when uh, her social media handle, uh, there was a post saying that uh, Poonam, who was in her hometown, she passed away because of cervical uh, cancer. In fact, details available from her uh, manager uh, stated that her cervical cancer was detected only in uh, the last stage she was at her home when her treatment was on however uh, uh, she lost the battle to cancer this morning now uh, speaking of uh, which uh, it was in fact uh, only in the last stage where we had seen that uh, Poonam's cancer was detected which is where she was at her hometown also further details from her manager state uh, that uh, the last rites considering uh, she was at her hometown would take place uh, at Kanpur itself uh, however uh, in fact, in the last uh, last some time, we also seen she taken a stance uh, on social media regarding luxury issue. Her very last post on social media was also uh, uh, was posted approximately two days back, and today this very unfortunate news has come out. Uh, there has been a statement which has been issued by her team as uh, well. However, uh, Poonam Pandey, who was uh, a social media uh, celebrity, uh, she had also risen to fame in 2011, where she had said that she would slip uh, if India won the World Cup, following which in 2013 she had a Bollywood debut. Uh, she acted in various uh, Kannada and uh, Telugu movies as well. Uh, but here, speaking particularly of cervical cancer, this has come yes. a day after uh, Finance Minister had announced in her budget speech about uh, providing FPV Absolutely. vaccines to uh, girls uh, from the Yesha, do stay on with us. Uh, Dr. Nahesh Trehan, uh, Managing Director uh, of, uh, and Chairman of Medanta, joining us on the broadcast. Uh, thank you so much for speaking with us here. Unfortunate circumstances that we're speaking in. Just yesterday, we had uh, the Finance Minister, the Central Government, you know, put out a proposal to try and help... Uh, uh, ensure there's more awareness about cervical cancer. Today we have someone as young as Poonam Pandey, all of the age of 32, passing away due to the illness. Yeah, so basically, as we said yesterday, after listening to the budget of uh, that was presented by the finance minister, that this was a very significant step. Because this has been on the anvil for a while, and all over the world, the, uh, the vaccine has been administered to young girls and younger women all over the world. So it was India is a little late in coming, but it's a very important step the government has taken that there will be a vaccine available and vaccination program going on aggressively for vaccinating younger, younger girls. So this is, I think, is now a testimony to the fact that the need for it is so, so much and the government has responded. So that's a very good thing to happen and hopefully these things won't happen in the future. Dr. Trihan, the most okay. uh, unfortunate bit about uh, cancer is that in most cases it does not get detected uh, until it's very late, perhaps also something that happened in Poonam Pandey's case. So awareness really is uh, the most important step, isn't it? The fact that early detection should yeah, happen, that you so should uh, get yourself checked regularly as well. No question, because this is already, there's a simple test known as pap smear, which we recommend at regular intervals for all females. But vaccine will also help a hugely, because it has all over the world, it has reduced the incidence of cervical cancer drastically. And I, I'm hoping that India will get the same. Dr. Trihan, thank you so much for speaking with us here on okay. CNN News 18. Okay. Uh,